Hello, hello, and welcome to Super Right. No, New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve uh, edition. Edi <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I'm representing what, we, what we've been wearing this year, you look which awful. is like the top is professional <laughs> and then the bottom is yes. relaxed. So see, this is us working this year. So hopefully next year we can go back to our old traditions on how we celebrate the New Year's Eve. And we've prepared for you a few foreign uh, traditions foreign. for New Year's Eve, the way it was before the year 2020, basically. For instance, we uh, when it's 12, we swipe. Midnight, yes. In midnight, we swipe. You swipe with what? The like the, the house. <laughs> <laughs> Not the credit card. <laughs> no, no, swipe. We swipe. My cousin, like five year old, like with a big suitcase. Uh -huh. My aunt, my mom, everyone. We were running, <laughs> and the police thought that we were robbing someone else's <laughs> house. Oh, my God. <laughs> so it's like, what are you doing? Yeah. And we were trying to explain it. No, this is they our know it's the no, tradition. No, no, they, they, yeah, they, oh, If you want love, you wear red underwear. If you want money, you wear yellow underwear. Yeah, and if you want to get naughty all year long, you wear dirty underwear. <laughs> That's you. The underwear is going to determine your year. Can you believe that? <laughs> so from all this banter, I will remain like this. <laughs> In Spain, I think most people know, but if you don't know, you at midnight, so during the countdown, you need to eat 12 grapes. Oh, yeah, in Mexico too. In Mexico too? Yeah. Yeah, I wonder why. Because every... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wonder why we yeah. have so many um, Spanish, uh, yes. Spanish traditions. On New Year's Day, uh -huh. the parents wake up their children by tapping the onion on their head. <laughs> tapping? Yes. For what? It's supposed to bring good luck, I guess. But that's what they do. If it's a cross, then it's not going to be a great year. But if it's the star, you can expect happiness. Oh, so probably oh all the... Can you believe how you can like condition yourself for an entire year, 365 <laughs> for days because of a fucking apple? Yeah, I would, I would, I would find it. Yes. Like that's weird. What kind of clothes is well, around? We need to picture it. I'm pretty sure you you're can... getting, you're getting there. <laughs> <laughs> the round shape. <laughs> yes. And we'll talk about resolutions after. Okay. Uh, if you're famous, you know that on New Year's Eve, somebody's going to burn. So your someone in, in, in Panama... The Probably they are, they are going to burn our pictures. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, make we us are famous. famous. <laughs> Please, I want to be burned <laughs> in Panama. This year, don't get me wrong, like this year was very good for me in many ways. Probably we, I didn't achieve half of the things that I wanted to achieve. Like it was for me, it was getting more fit. Mm -hmm. I was doing it, but then coronavirus, so... I didn't so you get have a, you have excuses. No, I ha yes, I have the excuse. That's why I don't have butt. You know, remember for me, you don't have butt. But yeah, ass. Oh, <laughs> I mean, bottom. I have a hole. <laughs> <laughs> Baby steps. So the first, 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 and let me give a. No, sorry. no, no! You interrupt me. <laughs> no, I was talking. Let me give just a number so we so no. we know where we're heading about re resolutions. By the end of January, uh -huh. only. <laughs> 25 people, 25 percent of the people actually stay committed to their resolution. By the end of January, by the end of February or and and March, only eight, eight percent, percent stay committed uh, to uh, their resolution. So, 92 percent of people making resolutions don't don't keep it at all. But there is one way to keep it to keep your resolutions is to do easy stuff. Yes, easy steps. If you want to get fit, the first one. I want to get fat. Oh, no, fit, fit, fit. Yeah, yeah I mean, no, you, you fat, got fat. Fat, fat. fat I did already. <laughs> but you don't, don't feel bad because I don't think you're the only one. There's okay. a lot of people that yeah. this year, especially exactly because of, of your uh, outfit today, <laughs> yeah. they got comfortable. <laughs> like, yeah, but you get comfortable with sweat, sweatpants yeah. and you don't feel like you're gaining weight until yeah. you are actually wanted to wear something like <laughs> pants. <laughs> and then you know, it's like, oh, shit. These are very tricky. <laughs> but like, okay, I cannot do it now, but... I'll do it after. And, Procrastination uh, is just the, it's the fact that you don't want to deal with stuff that are going to make you feel uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think that's. Yeah, that's should. procrastination. Yes. So that will be a resolution. So easy steps. Easy steps, yes. So. Easy steps and not, uh, not resolutions like, oh, I'm going to no, try no, to no, get no. back with my ex. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I want, <laughs> do you want to go back to your ex? 
No, I never wanted to get back with any of my exes because I think like once a story is uh, is like not a story, but like once you know it's not working, then you're going to go yeah. back to your old habits and it's wasting time. And on top of that, it's uh, like you can always say, oh, I made a mistake or whatever. But I think it's more because you're desperate because, you know, it's complicated to be to have that time of like uh, that type of uh, closeness and intimacy with someone. It mm -hmm. takes time. It takes work. Yeah. Uh, years of work and you're like oh i don't feel like doing that again so this year this year tinder it's gonna be your year 2021 no, I mean, that's, <laughs> that's not no, that's not one of my resolutions whatsoever no what is the thing that i have on my phone porn the, the <laughs> <laughs> happy new year happy new year bravo woohoo <laughs>